Hi folks, uh, this is uh, 39 Old Harbor Street, Unit 2 in South Boston. It's a uh, bi-level, two bedroom, one and a half bath condominium on the market for $480,000. Uh, Old Harbor Street is a one-way street and it uh, comes down off of, uh, comes off of Dorchester Street and it goes up to uh, Thomas Park which uh, is where people bring their dogs and uh, you know, oh, that door just slammed. Uh, bring their dogs and all that good stuff. So we're gonna head inside here. And we're gonna take a look at 39 Old Harbor Street. Uh, the unit was converted in 1997. The owner has done a ton of new improvements, including uh, a new uh, granite counter uh, kitchen here with uh, new stainless steel appliances. Um, looks really nice, really beautiful job. Um, so off the kitchen here you have the dining room. And the dining room has an awesome view of the city. Uh, so if you're having people uh, over for dinner, uh, they can look out to the uh, Prudential and they can look out to the uh, John Hancock building right from the dining room, which is great. So. We're going to head back inside here and we're going to take a look at the half bathroom that is off of the dining room. Okay. So we are also going to head into, uh, we'll give you another view of the kitchen here. We're also going to head uh, into the living room here now. Let's shut this door. And this living room is in the front of the building. Uh, it has a gas fireplace. There's the cat. Her name is Mimi. Mimi's a 17-year-old Siamese. I think she's 16 or 17. Hi, Mimi. Say hello, Mimi. All right, anyway, no cat videos here. Um, that's Marion Manor across the street. That is, a, um, that is a, an assisted living facility. Been there for years. Um, so we're going to head upstairs now. We'll give you one final look of the living room. All right. All right, so we're going to head upstairs. And these are where the bedrooms are. Little skylight right there on the top of the stairs. And we are going to head into the second bedroom. We'll take a master after we come back off of the roof deck. Uh, tons of closet space uh, in both of these bedrooms. Both have uh, two double closets. Um, and even a better view of outside, which we'll see in a second. So this is, she uses it as an off, excuse me, as an office. You can use it as a nursery, an office, second bedroom. Some people have talked about making it the master, but I don't think the flow would be right. Um, but you can do it. People have definitely thought about it. Um, all right, so we're going to head to this deck here. Uh, this is the third floor deck. This uh, unit has three levels of deck space, private deck space. And you have a view of uh, uh, the city skyline here. And we're going to get a better view up, up top here. And that's where we're going to head. We're going to head up these uh, circular stairs. And we're going to take a look and see what we got. So this deck up here is 19 by 19. It's huge. Uh, she's done a lot of entertaining up here. She's got some built-in seats, which is really cool. She's got electricity up here. She's got water up here. So, you know, it's ready to go for a nice little party. Um, they're going to be redoing this uh, property next door in the next uh, six months. It's going to be nice to have that done. And uh, it's probably the last building in the neighborhood that really needs to be done. All right, so this is the view. You have views of Dorchester Bay that way. Well, I guess we can't see it so well from here. Let me go over on the other side of the roof deck. So, well, I guess you can see it a little bit anyway. So Dorchester Bay, and that's the uh, Blue Hills over that way. And we're gonna go pan over to the Boston skyline that way. And then if that tree wasn't there, we'd have a beautiful view of downtown. So, 
they're thinking about maybe taking down one of those trees though when they uh, develop this property next door which again it would be another good thing for the view um, all right so let's head down off the roof deck again 19 by 19 really uh, cool really great for entertaining don't have too many drinks after coming off this thing though you don't want to fall off um, all right so we are now going to head back inside and we are going to go into the full bath, which is on the uh, top level of the unit. All right. And it does have double sinks and a stand up shower. And it has a separate whirlpool tub and uh, the toilette. Well, it's trying to be French, but I'm not. Anyway. Uh, that's the uh, stand-up washer and dryer on the second level as well. And then you have the master. And this has bay windows as, does, uh, as the um, living room below it does as, uh, as well. Um, has bay windows. And again, two sets of closets here. Double closets. So plenty of storage space. A lot of uh, area for entertaining. It's an awesome condition great location near the top of uh, Telegraph Hill or Dorchester Heights or Thomas Park as you might want to call it and this is the view coming down from the top of the stairs um, so it's a great place four hundred eighty thousand uh, dollars any questions uh, come by an open house uh, set up a showing with your broker and uh, we'll go from there thanks so much have yourself a good day bye bye